Hey guys, welcome to my home. I'm so glad that you're here. You may notice that this isn't, isn't actually her home and I'm not Becky, I'm Lily. And we are in our favorite place in the whole wide world, the mountains. And I have told mom that we are actually gonna be vlogging this experience. So, this was not her intention. She did not want to do this, but I'm doing it anyways. So I'm just going to bring you along. They didn't document their drive here. So we're just going to start with day one. Oh, hi. I didn't see you there. What you doing, Summer? I'm enjoying my nice mountain view and the fresh air. Would you like to see my view? Yeah. This is my creek. That just looks like trees. And, and this is where they they do the skiing are they taking people up on the ski lift clearly it is not ski weather your creek is over here summer this is my creek wait this is my creek oh you're glowing you can come out now <laughs> what are we looking at oh. watch watch right here there he goes oh he's riding a bicycle we it. don't see that back at home. <laughs> behind you. That was so interesting. <laughs> you are crazy. Hey everybody, welcome to the mountains. I'm so excited that you guys are here with us. Lily decided that she wanted to do a vlog, so what Lily wants, Lily usually gets. And Summer and I are just her pawns in this game. So we are on the balcony of our little rental place. Out here is where normally they would go skiing. The chairlifts are going up right now, but because it is not winter time, they're actually coming down with BMX bikes. It's kind of cool to watch. So I just saw one come down a minute ago, but we're gonna leave here in a few minutes. We're gonna go hiking, I don't know where. And then David said tomorrow he would take, take us antiquing. So hopefully we'll get to do some antiquing. Someone wants to be in the show. <laughs> it's my world. They're just living in it. Alright guys, we're off to our first destination. We're going to go hiking um, on Otter Trail and we're going to go find a waterfall. So stay tuned. Do they have otters on Otter Trail? No. No oh, otters? So. No. That's not fun. We saw water buffalo yesterday. We did. We did. We saw water buffalo, but it was not in the mountains. It was driving to the mountains. Can I request that you please insert the footage of our drive here? because yes. daddy took us down a dirt road in the middle of the mountains and we had no idea where we were. He knew where we were. No, he, he didn't. He knew where we were he, going. You made it here safe and sound. At least you guys had companions I just, to drive with. No, I just need you to see the video and understand the emotions that were running rampant through us as we were going down this dirt road. You're it was traumatic. It was traumatic. It's traumatic. Insert Trauma. footage here. Insert footage here. <laughs> I just need you to know. If you don't hear from us again, <laughs> he's <lucky>. got us. <laughs> GPS, I know where I'm going. <laughs> y'all are going to be very shameful when I pull y'all up in the driveway. Help us. His grandfather Mountain. You can see his nose and his eyes and his chin. And there's where his little feather goes up. That's the only mountain that I can identify because it's got his face on it. Okay guys, we made it to um, Otter Trail and we are hiking along. Hopefully dad doesn't have us take any detours this time because it's a steep trail. Some are the, it's not, the video is not facing you. So 
so we did this same trail last year when we came so we're doing it again because mom didn't get to come but i mean it's a pretty steep downhill trail so we'll keep you updated on how far we make it all right girls where you at we are otter trail. on otter trail right here in front of this waterfall it's not a very big one but when the waterfall comes down here Dang. down here that's the bigger waterfall. We we can't see that from where we are. We gotta go down the overlook. Yeah, there's people down there. We'll go back on the way back. Okay, let's go. Be nice. I'm not gonna do it. Fall. Fall on your tail. Didn't know he was gonna do it. He's a man of the wild now. All right, summer. Oh god. Oh god. You gotta go faster than that. All right, Lily, your turn. Strap your bag on. All right, my turn. <laughs> All right, guys, we made it back from Otter Trail. Um, Lily had an allergic reaction. I did. I got pricked by something and caused my leg to get itchy but it's going away now I don't think it was like poison ivy or anything you gonna say anything no no um she just wants to be on the video we have be included. we have some videos and stuff from the trail itself like walking and everything so I'm sure mom will input those in here but all right we're on to the next place hey guys welcome back so this is day two of our mountain blog so yesterday, after we went hiking, we went to a couple antique stores, got a couple things. Um, I'm sure uh, mom will let us do like a haul before we leave. Um, and we can show you everything that we've gotten while we're here. Um, we were pretty pooped out yesterday, I'm not gonna lie. So we didn't really film like each store that we went into or um, leaving each store and stuff. We were kind of exhausted I know I fell asleep in the car on the way to the last place that we went to so but today I think we're gonna um, go to a couple antique stores around town and maybe in a couple towns over it's a little chilly out today um, the wind is blowing pretty bad and it's calling for rain so we were thinking that it's probably not the best weather for hiking um, which is fine because uh, we'll come back to the mountains in July and then I can do all my hiking and everything that I like to do then so for now we'll just do what Summer and Mom want to do which is go antiquing and shopping and looking for all the goodies so um, I'll try to do better about filming now today and try to do better about getting mom to film today um, again because we were just not really <laughs> we we're just kind of trucking along yesterday so um, I'll try to remember and um, we'll have fun today. All right, see you later.
Hey guys, so we are shopping around, where are we at? Elizabethton? Yeah, Elizabethton. Um, we've been to two antique stores so far. Mm -hmm. I have racked up, I ain't even gonna lie to you. I have found so much stuff. Summer, on the other hand, she's being a little frugal today. I found a I little know, a Avon bottle, little lady Avon bottle. Yeah, I found quite a few cups to go on my shelf. So, and I think Mama's found a couple things. Um, so we're going to another one here down the road in just a second, and um, maybe we can do our haul tomorrow on yeah. day three. I'll have two things. Yeah, <laughs> and uh, I'll have a million. So yeah. All right. We'll see you in a little while. Hello. I'd like you to meet my family. This is Marcus. Theodore, and this is our lost cousin, Jan. <laughs> you see the bowls right there? I did see the bowls. <laughs> Hello, everybody. Summer and Becky here coming at you from the back seat. We are going down a windy road. <laughs> and <laughs> we are just uh -huh. before getting car sick, but we you might hear get a that? Further than just before. <laughs> if you're wondering what that noise is in the back seat, going left and right, left and right, it is the pot that Lily bought and did not secure down safely, so it is driving us crazy. Oh, <laughs> we'll be back in town shortly. We're going to where are we going? Mass We're going General. to the Mass Mass General yeah. Store. Right in now. Valley Cruces, and it is the most beautiful place, and we will see you there. See you at the creek. What you got there, sis? Ice cream. What kind of ice cream did you get? Oat milk cream pie. She got ice cream. Why would you lick it? You're supposed to bite it. <laughs> you gotta turn it. Hey guys, we are about to have dinner. Mom cooked for us. Lily is fast asleep on the couch. <laughs> um, but this is what she made for us. We have chicken parmesan and some angel hair pasta. And here is our chef. Hello. <laughs> We're very excited. Why are you turning it upside down like that? I was that? trying to turn it around. Um, that's the ocean what, what, what fictional what detective was created by Leslie Carteris? What fictional character? What fictional detective? A detective? Dick Tracy? No. Fiction, you've already been Is there a final answer? Who is the, not Nancy Drew, but what's the other one? 
The Hardy Boys? No. Simon Templer. Alright guys, welcome to day three of our mountain vacation. Um, today it is a little rainy, a little windy, a little cold, but that never stopped us before. So we're going to go hiking today anyways. We are double layered up with mm -hmm. rain jackets. We have extra clothes in case we get wet, but I'm going to be honest, I'm antiqued out. I can't do it anymore. I'm all done. I can't look at another knickknack or dusty old chair. So we're going hiking in the rain. A little bit of rain never hurt nobody. And we've got extra clothes in case we get wet. So it is what it is. Um, so we're gonna do that. And then after that, um, I think there's a couple places mom wanted to go to we might swing by, but. Antique store. Anyways. <laughs> so we'll try to keep you updated as much as we can today. Bye. Hey guys, we are on our first trail. Um, it's under the covering of trees, so we're really not getting too wet out here. It's a little chilly, but we're all layered up, so. Summer, you look a little apprehensive. What's the matter? I'd rather be antiquing. <laughs> <laughs> At least it's warm in the moldy antique stores. <laughs> all right, where are we going? Up. Up, okay, we're going up. All right, guys, so I'm just going to try and quickly show you everything that I got. I got a lot of cups, so I'm just going to show them really quickly. You're going to put the cups on your shelf that we showed in the last video decorating your apartment. Yes. So you tell them what you're doing in case somebody didn't see that video. video take longer. Huh? <laughs> I have a shelf in my house that I have a collection of a bunch of different colored cups that I'm going to line up and make like like a rainbow almost, but it's just like a bunch of different sizes, shapes, colors, all of the above. Okay. So I got this carnival glass teacup looking one. And I tried to get singles, but some of them I could only get in pairs. So I got these are carnival glass and they're just little, I don't know what they're called. And then I could only find a couple pink ones that were in my price range. So I got this cordial mm -hmm. glass. And then I think this is like a souffle sherbet glass. Sherbet. Yeah. And those are both pink. Then I got this blue one. And this one I think is also like a sherbet souffle type amber glass. I got this little green one. I got this little teacup. And then this one's not gonna go on my shelf, but Summer picked this out and I just thought it was really cute. It's like a little coffee cup. And then I got this little water glass and this red bubble glass. Mm -hmm. And then I got another green one. It's a little bit bigger. These are, I think, my favorite. This one's like a creamer cup and then this one's just like a know, goblet type cup. Sugar cream. Sugar creamer. Mm -hmm. But they're like the green carnival glass. Oh, my finger's stuck. And then I got these two red bubble teacups. That's all your glasses. Here. Okay. And then those are all my glasses. And then mom got me this. Actually, Summer paid for that. Summer got me this. Um, I don't know what it is. A candy dish? It's actually called a wedding dish. But, and I guess yeah. you, like, mom said you can sit it like that. Mm -hmm. And then I got these, oh, these books. They were all half off. It, it's um, like a little rainbow that I'm going to sit on my shelf. And then mom's trying to steal this from me, but I got this cool um, pot. Mm -hmm. And I'm gonna cook lots of goodies in it. Summer told me I couldn't use it, but I think that defeats the purpose of buying it. And then I got these two Reader's Digest books to replace the ones that we moved from my record player stand. And then I got three of these, what are they called? Canisters. Canisters that look like this, and I'm just gonna stack 
stack them up like this, probably. But I thought those were really cute. And then when you get home and you get all your glasses, will you send us a picture? Yeah. And I'll insert it in the video at the end, maybe? Of yeah. All of your glasses together sure. on your shelf. Yeah, I'll send you a picture of everything. Okay. All right, so we're going to switch out and let Summer come over and show you her little goodies. So my haul's a lot smaller than Lily's is. <laughs> I got this tiny candlestick. Um, my intention is to do like a, um, what's it called? A tear tray? A tear tray, like a mini vintage tear tray type of thing. And this, I've been looking at these everywhere and this antique store had them a little cheaper than what I've been seeing them. It's just an Avon bottle, but I just thought it was pretty. Um, and then I also got myself one and I bought Lily one, but it's, um, I believe it's pronounced a clotter ring. Um, it's an Irish ring. It's meant to symbolize, the heart is meant to symbolize love. The hands are meant to symbolize friendship and then the crown symbolizes loyalty. I think it's, um, it's like a, sort of like a promise ring or something like that. Um but I just got one for me and Lily, and that's all I got. <laughs> <laughs> all right, I will show you what I got next. It's my turn to show you what I got, and I did not find a lot. I think Lily was the big winner this, this trip with all of her glasses that she got, but she kind of has a project that she's working on, so she had a lot of stuff to look for. I did find some goodies, of course. You know, I'm gonna find some goodies. Um, I went into this one store, I think that's where I bought a majority of this, and the lady had 20% off in her booth, and her stuff just seemed to speak to me the most, I think. But the first thing is the most important, most beautiful thing I've ever seen are these beautiful dishes. They are pottery dishes. There's four in a grouping, and I'm trying to get the, the glare out a little bit. There's a glare, but it's all right they get the point there's not a mark marking on the back or anything but i have four of these i don't know what i'm going to do with them but i just think they are so beautiful this is everything that my aesthetic is about i just love these dishes so i'm going to find a special place for them of course and then she had this little tidbit tray that i got it is made with um, i believe to be indiana glass sandwich glass um i don't have one like this it was twenty dollars with twenty percent off so i got those those plates were twenty dollars as well with twenty percent off and then i got probably the cutest salt and pepper shakers you will ever see in your entire life let me show you we can change these around according to our moods this is if we're having a grumpy day and then if we're having a good day we can look like this or i can be grumpy and David can be happy, or David can be grumpy, and I can be sweet. <laughs> but these were $12 and worth every penny because they're the cutest things ever. And then I do like these glasses. These are Whitehall glasses. I got two of them. They were two for $5, so I don't need them, but I got them anyway. And then, of course, I got some stoneware. Let me show you. Um, I guess I'm going to have to start a new stoneware wall because I've added so much to my collection uh this was the smallest piece i do have a i do have this plate already but why not get another one it was only a dollar or two dollars or something like that so i got another one and then this one was two dollars i thought it was really pretty and then this one was two dollars as well and i just like them together so actually i like the three together I like the aesthetic of all three together so, we might be making a new stoneware wall in the house at some point in time. But that's all I got, unless David decides that he's going to let us go to another antique store on the way home tomorrow. We're headed home tomorrow. He said no. <laughs> but we're getting ready to have dinner and play some games. We've got some games over here. We went by to Walmart and they had a Trivial Pursuit game here, but it was Genius Edition and none of us can answer any of the questions. That's so. not true. I got three of my pegs because I'm a genius. Lily got three questions right. No. On genius Edition of Trivial got Pursuit. five questions right. Only three of them count it though. <laughs> All right, everybody. Good night. I uh, will talk to you tomorrow.
What's the matter? What's the matter? What's the matter? I'd like to know how you expect me to scoop myself. <laughs> I'm telling you though, but oh, did I hurt you a little bit? <laughs> What are y'all doing? Uh, what are y'all doing? I guess she needs some some attention. <laughs> she got she had a little she got a little upset. She having a minty bee? She had a little minty bee. Leave me alone. Where does your face start? <laughs> hey guys, we are packed up and ready to leave the mountains. We had a fun time full of laughter and Cheers. <laughs> we did good. Um, so we are all packed up and we are heading back home today, unfortunately. One last look at our waterfall, our creek. Our creek. My creek, Summer Creek. We thought it would be better to come down here, but it's a little loud, so sorry. <laughs> all right, well, thank you for tagging along with us on our mountain trip, and uh, we hope to see you next time. Bye. 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 Lily, what are you doing?